Hey, so today we're going to be opening up a 1990-91 season Skybox. I think this is the first season for Skybox. Uh, I remember when these came out uh, in, in 1990. I was in high school at the time, and I was a huge fan of, you know, collecting baseball cards. And then one of my friends told me, hey, you know, there's these basketball cards, uh, you know, by hoops. And I started collecting hoops cards. And then everybody told me that Skybox was even better. And, you know, they showed me a few, uh, you know, cards. And I immediately, you know, fell in love with them. And so I started collecting Skybox when I was younger. And I, I will have to say, this is my first ever, um, um, you know, opening up an entire box of Skybox. Uh, so th this is kind of exciting for me. I remember getting quite a few cards uh, back in the day. Uh, uh, Jordan and uh, you know David Robinson was probably the most uh, expensive one at the time. I think it was valued at something like twenty dollars or something like that. Which for a kid of sixteen years old, uh, <laughs> you know that's that's considered you know a ton of money. So. Anyway, we'll go ahead and get this thing started. If you like what you see here, you can always hit the like button. And you can also always subscribe. Uh, and uh, you'll see more unboxings. I, I got a few of these uh, off of eBay for a really good price. Uh, it was it was quite amazing for the price you know uh, it was going for. And I, I think I got three or four boxes. Uh, and they came in the mail. Uh, actually, they came in the mail this morning. Uh, which was quite funny because usually the mail uh, comes late in the afternoon. And, uh, you know, I got up this morning and all of a sudden uh, I found out they were on my front porch at like 7 in the morning. So I guess the postman wanted to get these boxes out of his truck uh, <laughs> as soon as possible. So anyway, we'll go ahead and get started. Uh, probably the, the obviously the biggest name we're going to look for, we're going to look for uh, Michael Jordan. Uh, this is, I guess, Series 1. I... I will be doing um, and I'm, a breaking of uh, Series 2 uh, in the near future, so look forward to that one. Uh, but we're going to look for Michael Jordan. I guess that's probably the most valued one at the moment. But there's a few other ones. I guess there's Kendall Gill and a few other names. But uh, it's all good. We're going we're gonna to check it out and uh, see how it goes. It looks like we have 36 packs here. Hopefully this won't take too long. I've gotten to the point where I can get a, a break done in less than an hour uh, even close to 45 50 minutes so that's pretty cool so but there's not going to be any stickers or any holograms or any special inserts so we'll just look for uh, particular players all right so we have uh, Rick Mahorn BJ Armstrong Jim Peterson Mike Brown Adrian Caldwell Mark Jackson uh, Scotty Pippen uh, Greg Anderson I'm going to flip it around. Uh, Randy Brewer. Uh, Randy Allen. Quentin Daly. Craig Hodges. Uh, Ed Pickney. Kevin Edwards. And Ricky Pierce. We got a lot of bulls in that one. We got uh, Scotty Pippen. I don't know how much his one is currently valued at, but I'm presuming it's valued halfway decent. All right. We have Kevin Duckworth. Uh, Terry Davis, Buck Williams, Jay Humphreys, Mark Akers, Daryl Walker, Chris Morris, Sam Vincent, uh, Greg Grant, Caldwell Jones, Bill Winnington, Xavier McDaniel. Uh, we already had our first checklist. Uh, Dave Hoppin and Scott Hastings. So, uh, in retrospect, <laughs> you know, in the 90s, these were considered cooler, but obviously the hoops... Uh, over time are considered, you know, a little bit better considering all the uh, stories behind some of their photos, like uh, the Sam Vincent and the uh, Mark Jackson. So I'll be opening one of those up uh, in the near future as well. All right, Chris Mullen, another checklist. Uh, Bill Cartwright, Randy Smreck, uh, Eric Johnson, Ricky Green, Tim Hardaway, uh, Dominique Wilkins, Brad Lohaus, uh, Paul Pressey, uh, Drazen Petrovitz, Raj Strickland, Lafayette Lever, Otis Thorpe, and Del Curry. Yeah, Drazen, that was a that was a sad story because he was a he was an awesome player. I really liked watching him uh, when he was on the Croatian team 
uh, during the 92 Olympics in Barcelona. He, uh, they were probably the biggest threat to the dream team, which, you know, really wasn't much of a threat. But once I heard, of, you know, we heard about him, uh, I felt really bad. All right, another checklist. Uh, Richard Anderson, uh, James Edwards, Jeff Sanders, Buck Johnson, Alex English, John Stockton, uh, Jeff Grayer, and then Charles Smith, Danny Ainge, uh, Michael Cage, John Conkak, Joe Klein, and Byron Scott, and and uh, Ronnie Seekley. I didn't realize uh, Danny Ainge played for the Sacramento Kings. I, in fact, I thought I didn't realize he uh, played a uh, major league baseball at the same time. I I, I didn't realize he was a multi-state, uh, multi-sport uh, player. So. Yeah, something similar with uh, Bo Jackson and Deion Sanders. All right, uh, Dave Corzine, Johnny Dawkins, Ralph Sampson, uh, Joe Morton, Larry Bird, uh, Craig Elo, and Brian Shaw, Mark Aguirre, Olden Polonese, Tom Tolbert, Theodore Edwards, Robert Parrish, Ed Neely, let's flip this around, Sam Mitchell, and Greg Kite. <laughs> yeah, I remember one time uh, my dad and I were watching a, a basketball game, and uh, it was it was I think maybe the Lakers versus the Celtics, and uh, they they showed Robert Parrish, and uh, they said he was like 38, and uh, my dad went, "That man is 38. Good lord, he looks like he's 60." <laughs> I think my dad was like, you know, hitting 40 at the time, and yeah, Robert Parrish definitely looked uh, a lot older uh, than he was. All right, Wayne Rollins, uh, John Williams, not to be confused with the uh, uh, best uh, composer of all time. Uh, Kevin Gamble, ben, uh, Benoit Benjamin, Kurt Rambis, uh, Mark McNamara, uh, Reggie Miller, Greg Anderson, Trent Tucker, Liddell Eagles, Jack Haley, Scott Skiles, Derek Smith, and Ooh Blob. Wow. And uh, James Donaldson. Yeah, uh, what was that? Uh, Jack, uh, Jack Haley. Man, was he on, like, I think he was on every team in the NBA at one point in time. <laughs> he hardly ever played. He was the definition of a bench warmer. But, man, if if you didn't always see his face somewhere on a team uh, for the matter of quite some time. I think he even was on the Lakers for a season or two. All right. We have Dale Griffith. Vernon Maxwell, uh, Dan Shays, Reggie Theus, Jay Humphreys, uh, Fred Roberts, Danny Young, Dana Barros, Blair Rasmussen, Rick Smits, Winston Bennett, Irvin Magic Johnson, uh, Steve Kerr, uh, Brian Rosum, and Kenny Smith. I think I'll save uh, the Magic Johnson there. I was a huge fan of his, being a uh, avid Lakers fan. In fact, uh, when I I was a I was a Lakers fan, but I, I lived uh, not in LA at the time. And then when I moved to Southern California, uh, it was right at the time he announced that he was retiring. Wow! First card, Michael Jeffrey Jordan. There we go. Let's take a look. See if. Uh, how this looks as far as the edges go. This is looking pretty nice. Looking looking pretty nice. Not seeing uh not seeing anything too bad here. Alright. So uh that's that's not bad. That's in the first stack here. We have uh Magic Johnson and we have Michael Jordan. Alright, we have a Chucky Brown, Michael Smith, Cliff Levingston, uh George McLeod, Andrew Lang, Joe Wolf. Rolando Blackman, Steve Hafner, uh, Steve Scott Hafner, uh, Maurice Cheeks, Eric Lechner, Mookie Blaylock, Terry Catledge, uh, Leonard Copeland, and Harold Presley. All right, we we're in the first quarter. And we already pulled both a Magic Johnson, a Larry Bird, and a Michael Jordan, and a Scottie Pippen. So. Uh, not, not too bad there. All right. Larry Nance, Stacy King, uh, John Bagley, 
uh, Detlef Schrempf, Tim Perry, AC Green, da Danny Manning, uh, Billy Thompson, Brian Quinnett, uh, Steve Coulter, uh, Derek Gervin, uh, Jerry Reynolds, Hershey Hawkins, Willie Anderson, and Adrian Dantley. Uh, funny story about AC Green. I think there was a time where uh, I think J.R. Reed uh, hit him with a uh, huge elbow on purpose uh, looking at the replays and uh, knocked out uh, two or three of his bottom AC Green's bottom teeth and this is right around the time where AC Green had a very long streak of uh, being an Iron Man in the NBA and uh, I remember uh, I think the following game or two uh, they would put AC Green out there just for a few minutes just so we could keep that streak alive so that was a uh, that was an interesting story at the time. We're on to the second stack. Let's let's see what we get here. We're, obviously, we're not going to get any uh, uh, Shaquille O'Neal's because he didn't come until 1992. But we'll we'll deal with uh, some good uh, Michael Jordans if we can. All right, we got another Roni Seekley, Larry Nance, Stacy King. We're definitely into the doubles here. Uh, John Bagley, Detlef Schrempf, <laughs> Tim Perry. AC Green again. I think we. I think these two packs are almost exactly the same. Danny Manning, uh, Billy Thompson, Bad Quinnette, Steve Coulter, Derek Gervin, Jerry Reynolds, Hershey Hawkins, and Willie Anderson. Man, that would have that would have sucked if I would have uh, grabbed those two packs <laughs> together as a kid. There was nothing worse than uh, picking up multiple packs and getting the exact same thing. It's, that, that's very defeating. You just want to just punch somebody almost all right cliff robinson uh david wingate todd lichty uh mitchell wiggins ken norman dennis rodman back when he was with a piston when uh with the bad boys uh tim tim kempton tyrone bokes glenn rivers uh dyron nix danny uh dan marley vlade divat uh joe dumars ed neely and Stuart Gray. Now, Vlade, I actually uh, saw him and, and got his autograph once. It was at a Toyota dealership. And I think his last name was pronounced. They said Divots a lot uh, in California. So that was that was an argument of a bunch of a lot of people who watched and didn't watch. Uh, Anthony Jones. Terry Cummings. Another checklist. Anthony Webb. William Bedford, uh, Michael Adams, Eric Floyd, Derek Harper, Chuck Person. Uh, he had a he had a uh, moment where he started kicking uh, balls into the stands during the uh, during the season. Uh, ben Coleman, Randy Brewer again, Randy Allen, Quentin Daly, Craig Hodges, and Kevin Edwards. Yeah, I think there was a I think there was it was a first round where the Pacers took. Some team to game five ended up losing in the end, but uh, it was must see must see TV because uh, they were expected to get swept and uh, didn't work out that way. Uh, Kenny Smith, uh, Mike Sanders, Mike McGee, Larry Drew, Bernard King, uh, John Sunvold, Johnny Newman, Mark Alari, Lester Connor, Sidney Green, uh, Mike Jaminski. Wayman Tisdale, uh, Steve Alford, uh, Jeff Malone, and Mark Price. I don't think there was a single double in that pack right there. You know, it's funny because as a kid, you don't really pay attention to, you know, corporate companies and all that. And, you know, you, you knew of the different card companies like Hoops and Skybox and Tops and Don Russ and Fleer and you know th this was back in the day where you know you, you picked one or the other you know Nintendo Sega McDonald's Burger King Domino's or Pizza Hut and so you know you you chose either Hoops or Skybox only to find out later I think they were owned by the exact same company <laughs> so you you really weren't you you really weren't uh, you know making any loyalty they were making money off you anyway uh, Zarco uh, Paspali Herb Williams, Chris Mullen, checklist, Bill Cartwright, Mike Smrek, 
Eric Johnson, Ricky Green, Tim Hardaway, Dominique Wilkins, Brad Lojas, Paul Presley, Drazen Petrovitz again, Raj Strickland, and Lafayette Lever. I think they call him Fat Lever. You know, that, that, that'd be a way to address somebody, to see him on the street go, Hey, Fat! All right, Adrian Dantley, Patrick Ewing. I think that's the first one we got of him. Uh, Brad Sellers, Michael Williams, Manute Bowl. He was uh, seven foot seven, and every once in a while he would chuck up a three. And uh, Thurl Bailey, uh, Anthony Bowie, uh, Jack Sigma, uh, J.R. Reed, uh, Billy Thompson, uh, Todd Murphy. Vinny Del Negro, Steve Johnson, Kiki Vanderway, and Vern Fleming. Uh, uh, Vinny Del Negro, he, I think, he, didn't he go to the Spurs and became uh, quite a prominent player for that team? I, I believe so. Let me know in the comments below. Man, these, you know, these uniforms, man, they had some, some short, short. <laughs> it's... All right, Delaney Rudd, Sam Bowie again, uh, the the guy who uh, got drafted over Michael Jordan, <laughs> David Corzine, uh, Johnny Darkins, Ralph Sampson, Joe John Morton, Larry Bird again, uh, Craig Elo, Brian Shaw, Mark Aguirre, Olden Polynes, Tim Tobert, Theodore Edwards, Robert Parrish, old man, and Ed Neely. Yeah, I used to play uh, basketball a lot back in these days. Uh, in fact, uh, a friend of mine and I, we were good friends. Uh, I was a huge fan of the Lakers, and he was a huge fan of uh, the Celtics. And we patterned our games uh, after those two teams. He could he could definitely shoot uh, mid-range and a three-pointer like no tomorrow. And I was definitely more of a, 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 a fast pace. Uh, Ricky Pierce, uh, Wayne Rollins, John Williams, Kevin Gamble. Ben, uh, Benoit Benjamin, Kurt Rambis, Mark McNamara, Reggie Miller, Greg Anderson, Trent Tucker, Adele Eagles, Jack Haley, Scott Skiles, Derek Smith, and Ooh Blob. So yeah, we we used to play just about every day. You know, as soon as we got home and uh, right around five o'clock, phone would ring and uh, come play some basketball. Well, let's go. Sometimes, whether or not it rained or shined, it didn't matter. All right. Uh, Michael Holton, Vinnie Johnson, the microwave, Sedale Three, uh, Kelvin Upshot, Mark Bryant, Mitch Richmond, uh, John Sunvold, uh, Donald Royal, Purvis Ellison, Sean Kemp. You know what? I'm going to put that one down. I liked him. Uh, Glenn Rice, LaSalle Thompson, Michael Cooper. And Clyde Drexler and Joe Barry Carroll. In fact, uh, that Michael Cooper, I think I have his autograph on that a Skybox card just like that. Uh, he was doing the signing somewhere, and I think that's the kind of card I put in front of him. Uh, I'll have to look it up. Maybe I'll show it uh, on one of my other breaks. But so far, we've... Not too, not too bad of a stack. We're we're at the halfway mark. We got uh, was it uh, 18 more packs to go? All right. Larry Drew, Bernard King, John Sunvold, Johnny Newman, Mark Alari, Lester Connor, Sidney Green, uh, Mike Gaminski, Wayman Tisdale, Steve Alford, Jeff Malone, Mark Price, Michael Holton, and Vinnie Johnson, and Sedale Three. Now I. We we had some strange nicknames. We had Fat Lever, but how does one get the nickname of the microwave? That that, that just doesn't make sense. Much sense to me. Maybe he was cooking people on the the court, and they didn't want to call him the stove. Which is actually kind of reminds me. We we had a guy who who played and ended up with a nickname Stovetop. So who who am I to uh? Throw stones. Uh, Rex Chapman, 
uh, John Long, uh, Jerome Lane, Nate McMillan, uh, Terry Teagle, Sam Perkins, uh, Charles Oakley, Scott Hafner, Tyrone Corbin, uh, Randy McRae, Derek McKee, Frank Cornett, Moses Malone, Grant Long, and Jerome Richardson. If we're lucky, we'll pull another uh, Michael Jordan out of here. If not, that's okay. This might actually uh, might be one of the ones I submit on my first submission to uh, the fine folks at PSA. All right, Michael Williams, Manute Bowl, Thurl Bailey, Anthony Bowie, Jack Sigma, J.R. Reed, Billy Thompson. Todd Murphy, Vinny Del Negro, Steve Johnson, Kiki Renderway, Vern Fleming, Charles Jones, David Robinson. There we go. There we go. The Admiral and Walter Davis. He was a, an excellent player. Excellent player. Stand-up guy. I think I think I don't think he's paid for a meal in uh, San Antonio uh, for the past thirty odd years. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure wherever he goes, uh, the the check is covered. All right, Jeff Hornacek, uh, Johnny Moore, Randy White, uh, Kevin McHale, uh, John Paxson, uh, Serenus uh, Marshallonis, Bobby Hansen, Larry Smith. Bill Lambeer, Isaiah Thomas, Larry Kristowiak, say that ten times fast, Tony Campbell, Cliff Robinson, and David Wingate. A few new names there. A lot of those guys have become uh, executives in the NBA lately, and uh, some of them are, have gotten pretty good. All right, John Williams again, uh, Kevin Gamble, uh, ben, <laughs> I want to say Benoit, but Benoit Benjamin, Kurt Rambis, Mark McNamara, Reggie Miller, Greg Anderson, Trent Tucker, Adele Eagles, Jack Haley, Scott Skiles, Derek Smith, Oob Lob, James Donaldson, and Mark Eaton. I think he passed away a few years ago. All right, uh, Kelvin Upshaw, Mark Bryant, Mitch Richmond, John Sunvold, uh, Donald Royal, Purvis Ellison, Sean Kemp, another Sean Kemp, all right, and Glenn Rice, LaSalle Thompson, uh, Michael Cooper, Clyde Drexler, uh, Joe Barry Curl, Kelly Tripuka, uh, <laughs> Kevin Willis, and Gary Grant. So it looks like a lot of these cards are going into the packs in kind of the same order. So since I don't know what came before the Jordan, uh, but, you know, it's a nice surprise. Nice surprise to see how it goes. All right. Uh, David Greenwood, uh, Brad Davis, Reggie Lewis. I was sad to hear his story. Uh, Jeff Martin, uh, Jerome Kersey, Tellus Frank, James Worthy. That was a guy I patterned my game after. I wish I had uh, the same kind of headgear. Uh, Brad Lohas, Michael Ansley, Will Perdue, uh, Purvis Short, Scott Brooks, Eddie Johnson, Sarko Paspali, and Herb Williams. In fact, uh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure anybody who uh, wore glasses and wanted to play a sport had to wear those very thick, uh, <laughs> very thick headgear that kind of, you know, felt like a vice on your skull. And by the time you finished playing, I mean, you, you had to rip the thing off because, I mean, it felt like your head was going to explode. All right. Armand Gilliam, uh, Alexander Volkov, uh, Tom Garrick, Wayne Cooper, Orlando Woolridge, the guy uh, who could never... Uh, <laughs> 
He never shot a ball he didn't like. That man uh, love, was ball dominant. They use that term now. He was very ball dominant. Uh, Terry Porter, uh, Jeff Grayer, uh, Jared, Gerald Wilkins, uh, Tom Hammonds, Dennis Hobson, Horace Grant, uh, Jeff Turner, Sean Elliott, uh, Roy Tireplay, and Tom Chambers. Tom Chambers, known with uh, the three-point slam, if he ever played uh, played him on the old Sega Genesis uh, EA games. I think it was Lakers versus Celtics. Uh, he was the only player that uh, could have a standing uh, three-point slam dunk. <laughs> you know, most other players, you had to do like a run and you'd hit the jump button and they go for a slam, but he, he would just be in a standing position and just just uh, slam it every time. It, it was pretty funny. Uh, Tab Lichty, uh, Mitchell Wiggins, Ken Norman, Dennis Rodman again, uh, Tim Kempton, Tyrone Bogues, Glenn Rivers, uh, Dyron Nix, Dan Marley, Vladi Divac, uh, Joe Dumars, Ed Neely, Stuart Gray, Delaney Rudd, and Sam Bowie. All right, so we're down to our final nine packs. We're almost at the half uh, half hour mark. So <laughs> we got a Magic Johnson, uh, Michael Jordan, Sean, a couple of Sean Kemp's, uh, David Robinson. Uh, folks, you can all, uh, if you like what you saw so far, you can always hit that thumbs up. You can always subscribe. Uh, help out the channel here. It's a young channel. I've only been doing this for a few weeks. Uh, kind of doing this for fun. Been buying a lot of packs of cards that I haven't, uh, wasn't able to purchase when I was younger. But now that I'm a little older, kids have moved out of the house, uh, I have a couple dollars to spend. And a lot of these boxes are insanely cheap. In fact, cheaper than what they were back in the day. So I could, I've snagged up a few. And so I'll be making a, a video about once a week. And, and maybe as the channel grows, I'll increase the, vi the amount of videos. But this is a whole lot of fun. This brings back to my childhood. Uh, uh, you know, going to the local uh, card shop. Uh, comic shop and uh, just uh, just opening up packs of uh, cards from different sports baseball basketball uh, football and uh, I think I even have some hockey coming my way uh, and, and I wasn't really a huge fan of hockey I was more into the other three well, actually I was more into basketball and baseball and then I eventually fell into football but uh, not so much to hockey all right Danny Ferry, I think this was his uh, first round draft pick. This, <laughs> uh, Rory Sparrow, Dwayne Farrell, uh, John Sally, Kevin Johnson, uh, Gerald Henderson, uh, Brad Doherty, uh, Dennis Johnson, oops, Ron Harper, uh, and then Byron Irvin, uh, Sherman Douglas, Alvin Robertson, Larry Kostowiak, Nick Anderson, and John Williams. Chances of pulling that out of Jordan is getting getting slimmer and slimmer. Okay, Mark Eaton, Rick Mahorn, BJ Armstrong, Jim Peterson, Mike Brown, Adrian Caldwell, Mark Jackson, Scotty Pippen again, Greg Anderson. Uh, Sidney Lowe, Antoine Carr, Dale Ellis, Eddie Lee Wilkins, Rod Higgins, and Robert Reed. All right, Mike Sanders. Uh, Mike McGee, Larry Drew, Bernard King, John Sunvold, Johnny Newman, Mark Alari, Lester Connor, Sidney Green, Mike Jaminski, Wayman Tisdale, Steve Alford, Jeff Malone, Mark Price, Michael Holton. I think it's safe to say maybe, I don't think any of those guys are in the Hall of Fame, but you know what? They can at least say they've been in the NBA. A lot of people cannot say the same thing. All right. Uh, Paul Mokeski, 
Uh, Charles Barkley. Oh, Charles Barkley. Wow. Uh, Rex Chapman. John Long. Jerome Lane. Nate McMillan. Uh, Terry Teagle. Uh, Sam Perkins. Charles Oakley. Stuart ha Scott Hafner. Tyrone Corbin. Uh, Rodney McRae. Derek McKee. Uh, Frank Cornett. And Moses Malo. Alright, we're down to the final five packs here, folks. Wow. Where does the time go? Oh, we got another Patrick Ewing. Uh, Brad Sellers. Uh, Michael Williams. Manute Bowl. Thurl Bailey. Anthony Bowie. Jack Sigma, J.R. Reed, Billy Thompson, uh, Charles Smith, Danny Ainge, Michael Cage, John Conkak, uh, Joe Klein, and Byron Scott. All right, we got a Pete Myers, Ron Anderson, Jeff Hornacek, Johnny Moore, Randy White, Kevin McHale, Checklist, John Paxson, Cernus Marcellonis, Bobby Hansen, Larry Smith, Bill Lane Beer, and Isaiah Thomas, uh, Larry Kostowiak, and lastly, Tony Campbell. All right, we're down to our last three packs. All right. Uh, Vinnie Johnson, Sedale Threat, Calvin Upshaw, Mark Bryant, Mitch Richmond, John Sunvold. Uh, Fred Roberts, Danny Young, Dana Barros, Blair Rasmussen, Rick Smits, Winston Bennett, Irvin Magic Johnson, uh, Steve Kerr, and Brian Rosen. Alright, so we have uh, another Magic Johnson. Alright, second to last pack. Will we get another Jordan? Carl Malone, the mailman, Bill Hanslick, Jim Paxson, John Battle, Winston Garland, Mark West, Michael Thompson, Akeem Olajuwon, Ben Coleman, Kenny Walker, Harvey Grant, Roy Henson, Otis Smith, Bob Thornton, and Frank Burkowski. We got an Akeem Olajuwon, future Hall of Famer and NBA champion. Last pack. Will we get one? Signs are pointing to uh, not very likely, but that's okay. All right. Grant Long. Jerome Richardson. David Greenwood. Brad Davis. Reggie Lewis. Jeff Martin. Jerome Kersey. Tellus Frank. James Worthy. Brad Lohaus. Michael Ansley. Will Purdue. Purvis Short, Scott Brooks, and for our last card, Eddie Johnson. So another Michael Jordan was not to be, but that's okay, folks. We got two Magic Johnsons, a David Robinson, and two Sean Kemp's, and a slew of other ones. We got uh, Charles Barkley, we got a couple of Larry Bird's, a couple of Isaiah Thomas's, a couple of David Robinson's. So, uh... All in all, not a bad uh, bit of opening there. Not a few packs there. And they all were felt to be in very good uh, 
very good shape. I didn't see any rounded corners for the most part, which is not bad for a set of cards that are, you know, 32, you know, what, 32 years old, 31 years old, uh, even 33, actually, it's 2023, so it's, it's quite amazing. Uh, these are kept in good shape, and as far as I see, I, I don't really see anything off as far as centering or anything goes, so yeah, I think I might uh, send this Jordan in. Oh, I'll wipe it off and uh, prob probably send it to the folks at PSA. So they could send it back to me and tell me it's a five. <laughs> and tell me I was way off uh, as far as uh, <laughs> as, as how I felt it's great it should be. But you know what? It's all fun here. I'm enjoying the heck out of opening these packs. Um, I did a few baseball packs. This is my first basketball pack uh, in quite a long time. Um, I have some more Skybox 1990. Uh, I have a Series 2 coming my way. Uh, I do have a hoops uh, basketball to open up, and I also have an upper deck basketball to open up. Uh, it's kind of harder to get some of the uh, basketball cards uh, simply because uh, they're, they've gotten so expensive. Uh, I think like this pack I got uh, between ten and twenty dollars, where some of uh, the other packs are starting to hit uh, into the hundreds, and uh, I just that just doesn't work for me at this time. Anyway. Um, what did you guys think about this, this break? Did you think it was pretty cool? Did you enjoy what you saw? Uh, tell me, post in the comments below, and if you liked it, like I said, you can always hit that thumbs up button, and if you want to see more, you can always subscribe. I'll try and post something, uh, every single week, and, uh, after this, I'll probably do another basketball, uh, with the Series 2, and then, uh, probably move on to football after that, and, uh, and then maybe even open up a box or two of, of hockey and try to do that kind of rotation right there. But I also have a few other uh, things that I opened up along the way, uh, like some Star Trek. Uh, don't have any Star Wars yet, uh, but I'm trying to open up, get a few other packs of other things, uh, some other specialty uh, cards coming out. And I found a few uh, specialty things on eBay. Uh, that might be pretty cool uh, that uh, you wouldn't see uh, every day. So... Anyway, thanks so much for watching, and uh, I'll talk to you guys next time.